So if you do not know by now, the OnePlus Nord CE2 is launching on the 2nd of February. Now that is a toned down version of the OnePlus Nord 2, so that is why the price is going to be lesser than the Nord 2. But now we got some details of yet another upcoming phone under the OnePlus Nord series and this one is the OnePlus Nord 2T. So it seems like after its flagship number series, OnePlus is now going to use the T branding for its Nord series as well. As the name shows, the OnePlus Nord 2T is quite the opposite of the Nord CE2. That is, it is an upgraded version of the last year's Nord 2 and hence it is going to be more expensive than that phone. Along with the name of this phone, we also got to know a few specifications of it. So in this video, let us talk about the OnePlus Nord 2T. First of all, the launch date of this phone is not yet known but we do know that it is coming very soon to the Indian market. Speaking of the upgrades that this phone brings over the OnePlus Nord 2, there is the Dimensity 1300 SoC compared to the Dimensity 1200. As of now, MediaTek has not launched any Dimensity 1300 chip but as the name suggests, the chip is definitely going to be more powerful than the 1200. Another upgrade comes in the charging speed. So the OnePlus Nord 2 already had extremely fast 65W fast charging but the Nord 2T is coming with even faster 80W charging. Even the OnePlus 10 Pro supports the same charging speed. And well, that is pretty much all about the upgrades. Everything else is mostly the same as the OnePlus Nord 2. So there is the same 6.43 inch 90Hz AMOLED, a 4500mAh battery and a 50 plus 8 plus 2 megapixel triple camera setup. We can expect the phone to launch with Oxygen OS 12 out of the box but if the launch is happening very soon then it is highly unlikely that OnePlus will offer Android 12 out of the box. Because as we know, the same happened with the OnePlus 9RT which launched with Oxygen OS 11 in India because of the issues with Oxygen OS 12. Anyways, what do you think of the OnePlus Nord 2T? Do let me know via the comment section below and as always, I will catch you in the next one.